Hello and welcome back to my channel for episode two of our UK recreation. For this episode, we are going to be looking at, and actually for the next few episodes, we're going to be looking at the route from Reading to Bristol. Still trying to complete the Great Western Main Line. So, today's route, if you'll excuse the loading, takes us from Reading up here, past the Cholesley and Wallingford Railway, through Didcot Parkway. Now we have to wait for the loading. Didcot is going to be our first stop. Then Swindon. And then I believe we are taking. No, it's this route. I think. Yes, through Bristol Parkway, and then into Bristol Temple Meads. Now we've got a bit of junctioning to do, which we will do. We will sort it out, ready for when we're going to need them. Now... I don't know, do we want to do freight or are we happy doing just passengers? I'll put that to you in the comments unless I can work out how to do a poll. Oh, and Pilning's got a high level and low level. That's going to be interesting when we get to it. Anyway. I'll see you over in Open TTD. Okay, so here we are. As you can see, I haven't simmed forward. But it, right, it's got hope. Right, they're still just spreading out. And I've actually, we've put three trains on there. And, yeah, it's not a good sign that we're in debt. But hopefully that will change as these towns grow. And I mean, grow. So I'm going to wait till we, we've actually got a bit of money. May change a few settings. Other than that, I'll see you when we're ready. You know what, let's just take out the rest of our loan. Actually, that may be enough. Right, first of all, we are going to want to build the route down to Reading West. Now we're not did cut
we get, well, this is just my representation of it. Oh. So I've got like a bypass that goes to Oxford. Okay, so we've got the line out to Didcot. Now let's carry it on out to. I'm lost. Oh no, Swindon. It's a jolly long distance, isn't it? Well, I'm just going to refer back to the map and see where we go from there. Okay, then. We're going very cheap to start with. We'll be able to upgrade all these lines a bit later on. Yeah, we really are not making that much money. But we will do. Oh my goodness. We've not even made it to Swindon. We've still got the entirety of Bristol to cover. That's growing. That's not growing. That's growing. That's growing. No, that's not growing. Brilliant. Passengers, two passengers, none. Well, that one's just picked up, and that's got six passengers. No, I guess two passengers. Right, anyway. Oh my goodness. 
we're out of cash again. We're not going to have enough money. We are not going to have enough money. It's just that simple. Because we're going to want Bristol Temple Meads here. They're going to want something like Bristol Parkway up here. Just a shame this isn't like transport fee or where they've got, they've got no costs mod. Sheldon's meant to be further north. Great. Actually, uh, I don't know. <coughs> Pardon me. And we are out of cash. Oh, come on. There we go. We'll take the train all the way out to Swindon. Without being able to take it out to Bristol. But we will eventually. We will get it out there eventually. Pardon me. Explosive sneezing. And we 
you will be renamed Ditka Parkway. Now we'll see if this is actually profitable. So I mean, you'd have thought that. Well, you'd have thought that a longer route it allows towns more time to get passengers to their stations. Hey, Jedka's got a passenger. Swindon's got a pa two passengers. We just need to hook up Bristol and Temple Ways and Bristol Parkway. Which we are not doing anytime soon. Because we simply cannot make a profit. In fact, I leave it a few years, see if you ever do turn a profit. But if we don't, I think we're going to be restarting yet again. But 25, maybe 50 years in the future. It'll be in this episode. I'm not restarting again. I'm not making another entire episode. <laughs> But we're not even cancelling our property maintenance. That's how bad it is. We didn't even make as much money in income as last year, let alone profit. I know, we, we just cannot make money. So simple. None of our trains are making money. Right now, start again. Get us to this same point, but twenty-five years in the future, with better locomotives. 
I'll see you then. Okay, so we got to about here last time. Way out of Swindon. <laughs> and yeah, whilst I was tinkering with the editor, I did find the cause of our woes. Construction costs had been set to high. I've now changed those to low, increased the maximum loan to 5 mil, and yeah. We were already making more profit than we were. Well, I mean, more income than we were. We are a long way from profitable. A long way from profit. As I'm sure anyone who did business at school will know. Okay. So then. I'll show you the map again to show you all the junctions that we are going to be building. But first, let's put in Bristol Temple Meads and Bristol Parkway very loosely. I will be adding some rivers over time. So yeah, you can expect the water landscape to look slightly more realistic than just the tip of the seven of the Humber. You know, we are almost We are almost the entire way across from the Thames estuary to the Severn. So yeah, that's exciting. We are within spitting distance of... making the first part of our goal. So then, I'll refer back to the map. No, not true football free. Anything but at this minute. You see how there used to be loads of stations along here. Okay, so we're going to have a junction going up to Cheltenham from just before Bristol Parkway. Then we've got this like triangle or depends on whether we want to do freight or not. Uh, quadrangle? No, not quadrangle. But anyway. So we've got a triangle junction just outside Bristol Temple Meads. We've got a junction that goes down to Seven Beach, which we may put in. I mean, there's no reason why we can't. Is there?
you can see where both Bristol City and the Clifton Suspension Bridge are. Oh, and there's Portishead, featured in a documentary a while ago that I watched. So, yeah, when do we make ever seven beach bit done today? Who knows? No, we don't want Google Play. Ah, so that's going to Chippenham. So we've made it to Bristol Parkway. Now that we have this triangle junction, which I've just built. Ooh, the Royal Scott has come out. And the Garrett, and the Shire, and the Suburban. Now, trains do terminate at Bristol Temple Meads. Oh, we had exactly one dollar or pound or whatever. Wait, in this case we're using pounds, aren't we? There we go. And you know what? Just treat ourselves. Oh, it'd be like somewhere up here, wouldn't it? The Seven Beach. Now, 
Now then, time to do the signaling. Which I failed to do up to. Oh, we never. I never built the bit out to Reading West. No, wrong type of signal. Why was that on bomb? So, as we continue into the Bristol area, so yeah, this video was due to come out on Saturday. But I just did not have time. So, yeah. Otherwise, videos will come out every Saturday, he says. You do realize you're going to have to keep that promise now. Yeah, I do, but still, it's an achievable target, and so, unless something is drastically wrong, it will be achieved. Still. We are taking you now all the way out to Bristol Temple Meads. And we need to do some station renaming. A lot. The station renaming. Did cut parkway. Now, I did search on the map for some stations in between to sort of break up this long hall, but there were none. Alright, Swindon, no, that stays the same. You are 
Bristol Parkway. And you are Bristol Temple Meads. Oh, and also, it just as a treat, we'll add the seven beach train in. And I think my rule of thumb will be depots will only be in London. Right, I say we go for the Metropolitan. Oh, great. Uh, with a clerestory carriage or two. Yep. And well, oh, and you once we get to Slough, you are going to the depot because we are cloning you. So we get seven trains on this route. So, yeah, slightly longer episode today than I would have wanted, but we are going to, we've completed our goal for today, which was to get down to Bristol Temp. Ah, oh, look, there was our train. Anyway, our goal was to get to Bristol Temple Meads, and we have done. Albeit with quite a bit of debt. So, yeah. Ooh, nice beefy load of passengers at Reading. Actually, something I might do is like a guess for station. So anyone who watches the episode, I'll start the episode at a certain station and you or maybe even a junction and you have to guess where it is so then currently got three four five Six, seven.
Chippenham somehow isn't affected. See if I is part of the main line complete. But nowhere near all of it. Because along with the GWR mainline, we're going to be doing the entirety of Somerset, Court, Devon and Cornwall. And then moving on to the southern mainline. And we're just going to do the main lines in turn. And create appropriate services. So yeah, until next time, see you later, goodbye.